record is yeah. Wacky no, Wednesday. <laughs> That's a lot of buttons to push now. We got a lot of people in here. We got uh, got Gary Semenov over there, and he's got, he's recording us. So this is going to go on uh, probably on our Facebook page or something. Uh, today, and we got Rob Fry. Today. <laughs> hey, we got like six, eight more buttons that we can push on there. That's true, but we don't have six or eight more mics. Well, yeah, we, we, we could find them. them. I have about forty of them at home. Well, I don't know. There we go. That's good. Have a whole jam session. Oh, yeah. Party in here. Well, that's coming. You know, that, that kind of stuff is coming to uh, caremoradio.com. Hey, if you were our own sports center, that's what we need to put in here. Mm. Not big enough. Well, we had Candace Copley in here. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I didn't do the greatest job of recording her, but it sounded really good. It sounded awesome. Well, yeah. She's got a nice voice, though. Yeah. I've known Candace for a bit. And, I mean, she's. So that that's. She opened up. She's the beginning of the, uh, of the live. Uh, shows that we're going to be doing here at Fairbury.com. It's a busy place. It's a, it is. It's a, a ten man job and to, or a woman doesn't matter. And there's only two of us really. Mm -hmm. And then our volunteers, of course, and we appreciate you guys dropping yeah, by. Yes, absolutely. So yeah, there are a lot of things that are in the works at Fairbury.com. This is a new, totally new way to listen to radio in the Caribbean, and that's uh, we don't want to sound like anything else. And I have a feeling we're doing that. <laughs> we're doing that today, don't worry. Okay. Well, let's get back to Waggy Wednesdays. So. Alrighty. Well, um, it was well look meaningfully at Gary. Okay, Gary, hand that telephone over right now. Okay, okay, just hand it over. So, Gary Semenov, how are you doing today? I'm just wonderful. How about you guys? Pretty darn good. That's wonderful, too. So you got some good news about some entertainment coming up? Yeah, this Friday night, we got two music events happening in one night. Uh, we got the 108 Mile Solid Rock Cafe with my buddy Doug Steven, and uh, I'm not sure who all the music talent is there, but he's got a lineup already, and he's, he says it's going to be awesome. Yeah, I actually was there last year, as you mentioned, and did some videotaping, and it's a, quite a crowd, actually. The parking lot's usually just stuffed. It is. So, uh, good, good place to go. Find it all is. different types of entertainment, the, the styles of music. It is. And what are they charging to get into that? It's free. It's free. I free. like those words. So should everybody else. Free. <laughs> yeah. You know, and it's entertainment. It's a good night to get out and do something. And it's family uh, oriented. It is. It is. It's very good. Awesome. And then on Friday night, also the same night, we have a jam session at the Royal Canadian Legion up at 99 Mile Hill. All right. And that's from 7 to 11. And we got lots of musicians, musicians showing up there. And uh, uh, the rumor is that even my buddy Hank Henry Palin might even show up and play some, right. play some tunes up there too. Nice. Yep. And uh, maybe we might even have a drummer this time. <laughs> a drummer always helps for the yes, band. Yes, drummer's always good. Yes. <laughs> you They're can't beat a drummer. <laughs> yeah. uh, we can beat you. <laughs> <laughs> All we do have to do is catch you in a snare first. Ah! <laughs> 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 Hopefully the mics aren't on. Uh, oh no, they're all on now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I got something real big to talk about here in my hand. So, you, are you finished over there, Gary? Yes, I am. Okay. So, uh, coming up this Saturday is Don X right here in the South Caribou. It's their 45th anniversary. Can you imagine that? 45 years. 20% 20, 20 off. What are you guys giggling about? We'll tell you later. Okay, twenty percent off everything in the store except dispense, like except post office, digital. No, there's ten percent. Oh, there's not twenty percent off digital. There's ten percent off digital cameras. So we're getting confused here. And the lotto. There's not no discount on lotto or post office stuff. Uh, so, um, so twenty percent off the lowest price still. So when you find something that's got a low price on it, it's still twenty percent more off. Uh, you can enter to win one of three gift, certi gift certificates as well. One's uh, 300 bucks, 200 bucks, and $100. Nice. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, all 10% off all digital cameras. So uh, get shopping right now for, uh, you can start your Christmas shopping early, I guess, at Donix. Uh, this has got such a good deal going on there. And what else they got? Well, of course, we already talked about uh, getting your flu shot. And uh, the Screaming Reel department, of course, is the best place to shop for fishing gear in the in the caribou and they got the best deals i already heard that many many times the prices at the screaming wheel are uh, the screaming wheel are just uh, the best ones around so absolutely it's saturday hit hit donix hard and i do believe larry road from the world's going to be there as well 
Uh, make sure you harass him every time. Yeah, you give see him a yeah. slap when you walk by. Whatever you, whatever you need. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so there you go. Big sale, 45, 45th anniversary sale coming up this Saturday at Donix. Be there or be square. It's have to be square. I know. So it says so you'll be there. in the news. There you go. All right. Who's uh, next? Well, okay, I'll uh, carry on here. Uh, just talked about the SPCA event up in Quinell, so we'll talk about the ones coming up down here. 15th Annual SPCA Dinner and Auction, and that's happening Saturday, October 27th, in the Valley Room, uh, behind the Red Coach Inn here in Hunter Mile House. Uh, the uh, doors are opening at 5 p.m., the dinner is at 6, and the auction starts at 7. Uh, dinner's going to be catered by Smitty's. It's going to be roast beef, chicken, mashed potatoes, uh, steamed veggies, three salads, buns, desserts, tea, coffee... What more do you want? Tickets are $25. You can get them at Fascination Street, Total Pet, Donex, and Pharmasave. There are only 100 tickets available, and the cutoff is October the 24th at 5 p.m. So there you go. There are no tickets being sold at the door. Yeah. There we go. Well, you know what? We've also got the uh, 100 Mile House and District uh, Women's... Uh, Move to the mic. <laughs> the 100 Mile House and District uh, Women's Center is having an annual Halloween bake sale at the, uh, at the center at 102-475 Birch Avenue from October 31st from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. That ought to have a lot of goodies. I think so. Wow. <laughs> Go ahead, Chris. You got something else right. in your hand? I can oh, see you holding up your hand. All kinds of stuff here. Uh, oh, we've got Halloween Town, of course. That's coming up. Oh, yeah. uh, October the 31st, Halloween Town, 5 to 9 p.m. at the South Caribou Recreation Center. Uh, a free family event, of course, and uh, they do this every year. There's a huge bonfire, there's fireworks, ice skating, the costume prizes, movies, free candy for the kids, and, of course, the BSO grads are putting on their haunted house. Mm -hmm. And there are uh, various scare <laughs> levels involved. Oh, yes. There's three different scare levels, I think. You know what? i, I got to give kudos to these kids. Each year, it's always a different batch of kids that get in there mm -hmm. and, and with their grad program. And, I mean, I tell you, these guys put together one heck of a little maze. Oh, I know. You know I've been through there. It's, I don't know where they found all that space. Well, uh, it is a fundraiser for the, for the PSL grad, so there is an admission fee into the haunted house, but it's well worth it. Oh, yeah. You know, and I did take my little guys through there, my wife and I, and we nervously giggled our way through. <laughs> uh, but you, you went through the level one scare then <laughs> we did we went to the well we asked for the most scariest one whichever that one was but uh, getting back to the fireworks now uh, I know they need some more help they need some more financial help and we did do we donated here at caribouradio.com towards uh, the uh the fireworks, but uh, anybody out there listening, what's the contact number there, Chris? Uh, the contact number is, um, mm, yeah, actually there isn't a contact number here, but I imagine it's uh, through camera and you can get a hold of it through there. Or, or the Chamber of Commerce here or in the South Carolina. Yeah, Angela Cole, right? Yeah, Angela yeah. Cole, and I, what's, we should know their numbers off by heart by now, but either way, uh, if you can, please donate to the fireworks. They're such a great show every year. Yes, and you quite literally get more bang for your buck. Exactly. Sorry. <laughs> had to say that. <laughs> okay. Well, let me see. I got. Uh, what do I have here? Oh, uh, here's something keeping with the Halloween theme. October 31st, uh, 10 a.m. till 12 p.m. I guess that's uh, lunch at Botania Park in Williams Lake. Strong Start is hosting a Halloween costume parade on Wednesday. Wear your costume and go through the Halloween obstacle course. Everyone zero to five, and I don't zero to five. Uh, years of age is welcome. There's, there's no real contact number. I guess you just show up at Botania Park at 10 a.m. on October the 31st. So is that physically or mentally? Uh, what part? <laughs> uh, the zero, zero to five. five. I, uh, yeah, I don't know. I think uh, they just mean no one over five. I don't know what a zero is. I just don't know. <laughs> that would be just like fresh born baby, I guess. <laughs> Still would be more than zero. So anyway, you get the point. Uh, yeah. Get the Obviously, price of the one day, so one day old day. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up on October the 20th, uh, there is a turkey dinner at the Lackadatch Old Age Pensioners Organization Center. And that is at 5 p.m. Uh, tickets are $12 at the door, and they have a takeout service available at the back door. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's pretty funny, but it's good. You know, everybody loves turkey. <laughs> so if you can't get enough inside, you can whip around the back and get some. There you go. <laughs> yeah, this is a family radio station here, guys. Come on. Yeah, this is. we're talking about turkey dinner. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know where your mind is. Yeah, well, who knows? <laughs> 
Anyway, uh, we want to take a quick break, get back into some uh, tunes for a few minutes, and regather ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Exactly. Uh. Okay, so let's do that. Ah, the best music. 